have. Let me play them side by side because this is your choice. Here he is. It's an umbrella term. Don't worry about it. They're fine. They're totally fine. This guy, God gives me the opportunity to come and even with a wheelchair, shoot the Jews. Let me ask you, America, because this is your choice. Which one do you believe? Mr. Bald Egghead, who doesn't have a clue, or this guy? Now, let's say this. Oh, people would punish them for their corruption. The last punishment was carried out by Hitler. Which one's telling you the truth? Which one? Let me give you your options here. If you listen to these pinheads, and he's telling the truth, you're dead. Israel, dead. If he's telling the truth, and you trust him, you're dead. If he's lying, and you trust him, you're fine. But he better be lying, or you're dead. Got it? It's just that easy. We went through this in 1999, where I said the same damn thing about Osama bin Laden. Well, if he's like, he's lying. He's just saying that. He's a politician. He's just trying to stir his own people up. Really? Tell that to the 3,000 people in the building. Tell it. Tell it now. Oh, I was wrong. Tell it to the Israelites. Tell it to the people that live in Israel. Tell it to the people just like, what was that stupid 34-year-old uh, psychiatrist who says, <laughs> I know they have an agenda, but they like me. No, they do. Do they? Tell it to Daniel Pearl. <sighs> I'm sorry, but I am, uh, I'm tired. I'm tired of it. And I know you are too. What will it take? Oh, it's a historic day. Some people think we're having a 1776 moment. No, no. We're having July 14th, 1789. That's the one that ended with the guillotines in France. They were both revolutions. Isn't it great? They're both calling for freedom. No! One ended with bloodshed and guillotines. There is a difference. More in a minute.